Blue Origin. Maybe the best shop I've ever seen after being at so many factories and, and machine shops. It was insane. I've heard the term Rocket City, but I didn't really understand it until I actually went up there. And you know, there's like way over 300 major aerospace companies in this small place. You have so many different large companies vying for your talent that they have to take very good care of you. I know like Blue is paying top dollar. They're helping people move into Huntsville. They're actually like putting down some good money. We showed some incredible technology. We showed some incredible machinery. We showed opportunity. There's people out there that right now could be like suffering in life because they lost an opportunity or they're just struggling. And all of a sudden you put out a video like that. They see something that no other major aerospace companies doing by opening up the doors and showing what they're actually making. They're making the greatest engines in the world and a lot of them and it's crazy. And they're hiring over 200 machinists. So there's people that literally will watch that video, go down into that link underneath that video or even on this one and actually click that, get in a conversation with them, end up getting hired for some really good money and uh, just take an opportunity that will just change their life. If you are watching this video, go watch that video we put out on Tuesday about Blue Origin. And when you watch that, share it with other people. If you know somebody who you know is a woman and, and that they need an opportunity or could yeah. use a, a better opportunity, introduce them to manufacturing because it's, it's, it's not about a, a man or a woman thing, it's about an ability and, and who you are and. You know, the head you have on your shoulders and your willingness to work at, at something and be great at it. And it's just a great opportunity for every single person who cares about religion or race or male, female or anything. Anybody, you can go over there and, and create an amazing life for yourself and make good money. Early 2009, and, and I, was, I was deep in it, came to a spot where it's like, man, if I don't get a certain amount of work or a certain amount of money, I'm gonna have to lay more people off. And and I was just, I was praying for work and praying for work. And literally I get this call and I've, I've, people have heard me talk about this before, but now you actually see in that video that we just posted, you see the person that actually called me. And it was like, I'm praying for work and I'm, I'm thinking of everything I can comprehend. And then I just get a call from Kent Washington from somebody from a company called Blue. And I'm like, Blue who? Hey, you and I work together at a different rocket company. And now I'm over here. And and I was like, that is the craziest thing. And right. then he they were having problems with vendors. And all of a sudden, he called me up. And we just went on a tear for like the entire year through that whole process and going into many many years after that we would end up machining most of the complicated parts for the be3 engine all the prototypes like every day i was just working with this engineer and other engineers and and we were just making parts hard parts crazy tolerances and stuff but it's just the craziest thing that i didn't know and then he calls me, gives us the perfect amount of work and the perfect amount that created the perfect amount of money for me to actually support my entire team and keep our company afloat. And then through that whole process and years and years, they one day would have confidence with us to actually open their doors. There came a time where I said, hey, we're not actually gonna make machine parts for you anymore. We're gonna go in a different direction but we're gonna be a best friend because the people that you wanna hire, we're gonna train them to actually make incredible parts out of incredible material. And we're gonna teach things that nobody else in this world teaches. It's like when I was coming to the end of the year, back when I first was working with Blue and stuff, you know, I, I was I was like suffering, man. I was like praying on that bridge, man. And, and just like, I was just begging God to save my company and stuff. And I always say, if somebody at that moment would have just looked at me and said, you know what, everything's gonna be good. You're gonna actually save your company. You know, you're going to, you know, 
have a TV show and, and create, have the amazing team. You're going to live in Texas and Keith is going to like work there and you know, Billy and Jesse and have this incredible media team. Like it was, it was all impossible. And yet look at what life has served up. So I'm like, you know, anybody out there going through it, just keep looking for the light, no matter how dark it gets, man, have the courage to step forward to, to, to just, you know, spend time on your knees and, and, and just pray for those opportunities, man. And they, they come like they come and it might be different than what you thought life was going to be, but it will be so much greater because of what you went through and stuff. And, uh, the hardest times that we go through is what qualifies us to do the greatest work of our lives. If it's easy, everyone, everyone would be doing it. Do it.